What's good, everybody? It's your boy Salute the General here with the homie Joe. Ready to check out Terror Season 1, Episode 3. Last episode, we had, um, they came across some kind of monster bear thingy. I don't know what the hell it was. It looked like a and wolf. Creature. Yeah, something. I don't know what it was. I think it had something to do with what they said in the first episode when my man was like a thing made of muscles and something. So, I'm assuming that's what the hell that thing was. Um, they still stuck out there. It's been eight months. They was out there. Out there forever. That shit is crazy. Um, Shot the Asian man. Oh yeah, the the Asian dude who appeared in the dude's dream or in the first episode. That's the same one. That was definitely the same guy. I think. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely think. But definitely whatever. Definitely think. <laughs> um, yeah. He ended up getting shot and he died. And the the chick was trying to say that she needed to take him to the snow to die. He needed to die outside he or something. Die outside. Yeah. Snow, right and, uh, <laughs> but he didn't die there. He died on that damn bed. Mm. Um, we also seen that what's his name knows how to talk whatever language they're talking. I don't know what his name is. The other captain from mm. the other ship, Uberus yeah. or whatever. Oh, yeah. Erebus. 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 Whatever. Still don't got the name. Erebus. Well, yeah, we're going to go ahead and check this episode out and then uh, have a little discussion when it's over. Let's get it. Some of us became convinced that the bad. wasn't a bad. I missed it again, <laughs> baby. I missed it. I'm looking right at it and I missed it again. Yeah, I think that so that's how it's supposed to be. You know what I mean? Erebus. Like Days show, right? later. Oh, that's right. That little, uh, the chick told them they need to get up out of there or they were going to disappear or some shit. I'll trade mm. myself pork tonight for another watch if we don't see it. Yeah. That's spooky. Shadow killed him, man. He thought he was shooting at that bear I'm thing, though. Back. There's something more in here. There's another one here. Man's got charms falling off him like a plum tree. What the fuck are those little trinkets? She don't even get to be there when they do all this to, to the bed. Guess not. Wait, you and get on with it. Departs according to Dr. McDonald's account. <sighs> Having yourself handled his corpse, is it your opinion he retains sensation? Mm -hmm. okay. Doesn't that mean that they eventually they might find the body hole still if it frees up in the water? Well, what was that? In by the wolf thing. <laughs> oh, except for the men of the mind. They have to keep their focus on hunting the bear. The fact they keep calling this shit a bear, I know it ain't no bear. If the party leaves now, they'll have three full months to get there before winter comes in force. Three, that is 800 four, miles. Francis. Oh. 800 miles? I do not grant permission. I'd rather send out eight men now for a long, unnecessary walk than risk a necessary one for all of us in a year. I will not allow it. What Only signal eight men. would that send to the world? I will not lose another man. Francis. We may lose all our men. That is what my alarm is ringing now, Sir John. And I, I'm at a loss why yours is not. You are the worst kind of second, Francis. Mm. 
worst kind of sick. You abuse your freedom. Yeah, I think you he's the second in command. In the safety of speculation. It will have to act as the only eulogy our boy Graham will be given out here. And I intend it to sink. This is the second time this motherfucker has tried to talk to this motherfucker about some real so shit. Doing some shit. Yeah. And this motherfucker don't want to listen. Don't want to listen at all. I lead the party myself. With mm. my presence, the other members of the team can say they were coerced. I'll tell them it's a hunting party at first. The outfit won't impugn them. Yeah, and if we were to meet Eskimo. Hi there. <laughs> yeah. Write it down this time, Mr. Diggle. Yeah, this is 1860 something. He almost lost it right there. He's in his foot slide open on the So just keep your foot out of it now, please. I never get the whole thing. He's so assured he wants to. To think you were such a good wife to me all these months. I'll go to hell. <laughs> We've had our beer and skittles, but your tastes are no rule for mine. <laughs> oh no. Because I've seen more of your pasta than your face this winter. So far, really. yeah. huh? Hold still. Not a twitch. What the fuck is he so scared of all the time, you know? <laughs> they ain't have no megapixels back then, man. He didn't get it. I'm pretty sure it did, but what the fuck is he so... I guess maybe that fucking... Bear wolf. He don't want to be outside. Man, he got the fish just hanging there like... I think they hunt the bear. Mm-hmm. Seems like everybody had neat writing back then, man. You may return to the ship, Mr. Goetzer. Do you need a chaperone? Yes. <laughs> or you may stay with us. Yes, I need a chaperone. What the fuck? Bruh, what the fuck was that? That's a bear, yeah. Fuck no, he gonna send that damn rescue team now. Send our marines! Oh Damn, it's cold as shit. <laughs> Did he pick up the, the the doctor dude? Oh! He about to be in charge, in charge. This motherfucker's about to die. Oh, the fucking hole. Still trying to figure out what the fuck did it, and it's obviously linked to that Eskimo guy. Oh, You're in charge one. now. Now he's number one. Just like that. <laughs> His foot. Oh, 
least they didn't get him. I feel like he's linked to this somehow. Though. Every time he gets those little scary ass panic attacks, that thing shows up. And one thing only. Yeah, I'm tripping these niggas are still calling it bear. It she lifted a motherfucker out of the tent. You know how big that bitch gotta be? Never wanted anything as little as I want this now. He don't seem like he really needs that Mr. Blanky, proceed immediately with the rescue party. I damn should be scared of shit to be on that rescue party squad. I know I got a three month hike I and I got this fucking fast, bear. Or <laughs> whatever the fuck this shit is. Get to running, boy. Just get away from there. 800 miles, you know? Can they really do 800 miles in three months? Which is yet more immense than the one we see. For in this world dwell the angels who keep us. Who will not leave us? Mm, and the about to go get it in with somebody. Will cleave from the frame that carried them. The invisible world of spirits, though unseen, was present for Jacob. What the fuck is he doing here? Not future. Not distance. He's gonna take a shit on this nigga's bed. Present. And it is now. Yeah, and it is here. Among us, if we open our Whose eyes, bed is that, though? This is uh, his lover boy? Amongst us. <laughs> or. Mm -hmm. I'm saying it's not even just like three months of you go. You gotta bring supplies with you to eat. Fuck. You gotta live for three months. Yeah, you see how fuck yeah, that thing has to be huge. If that's his breath. Bitch. Is this thing like a spirit thing or something now? I don't know what the fuck this thing is, B. What the fuck did it go? Got camouflage skills? Oh, food. Brought her food. It's probably her dad or whatever that thing is. Or well, whatever he was. And yeah, it was her dad, right? Alright, um, that was, uh, episode three. They keep teasing us with this damn monster creature. thing, whatever the hell it is. Monster creature. Um, it's fucked up. R.I.P. Sir John. Go on, boy. Go on. Killed the ass. Yo, how big is this motherfucking thing, big. son? Because it definitely picked that guy up out of the tent, right? And Definitely. like just snatched him like way up in the air. I thought like it like he went up kind of high. I don't know. Crazy. I have no. I think I definitely think it's linked to the Eskimo guy that died. Cause that's why I was with that thing throw him down, Sir John down the hole. When Sir John is the one that said to throw the Eskimo guy down the hole. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? So he had to know something. Yeah, he threw his ass smooth down the hole, ripped his legs off. Left one leg out there for him. <laughs> and then my man suited that joint up and put it in the casket with the bag, the leg. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> That's <Yeah>. crazy. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, and I also think that doctor guy, he seems to be real paranoid. And every time he gets scared like that, that damn thing shows up. Mm -hmm. I have no idea what the hell is going on. You know but... That. Now my man is in in charge. What is his name? Damn. We'll get it by the next episode. Um, yeah. He's sending out that rescue party. Three months, 800 miles. Pulling a heavy-ass boat. 
behind you? You making it? Me neither. <laughs> Damn sure ain't making it. Um, yeah, but it was an okay episode. Um, got a little long in the tooth in the middle. <laughs> it was just kind of like dragging it on, but then when the monster thing showed up, picked up a little bit. Lost Sir John and everybody else that was out there, it seemed like, except for the camera guy, the doctor. Mm. Um, Hopefully he got that picture. Yeah. That was like 30 seconds he had to wait, right? And my man told him, don't flinch, don't move. Mm-hmm. Whatever. <laughs> yeah. Well, like I said, it was an okay episode. We're going to go ahead and check on out. If you enjoyed this episode and this video, make sure you click the thumbs up. Also, make sure to share and subscribe. Let us know in the comments section what you thought. And uh, we'll catch y'all for the next episode. Salute the general. Homie Joe, we gone.